All right, restart. Let's record us. <laughs> Let's <Okay>. restart. <laughs> Welcome into another edition of the Potpourri. I'm Jacob Larson. On today's show, we're going to have a Super Bowl recap. We're going to talk about Bruce Jenner, what's going on there. Mariah Carey, she failed at lip syncing. And then we're going to talk about the Grammys, which are this weekend. So uh, I'm here joined by Holly Swate, our executive producer. Xavier's not here right now. He's busy. That's all we can say about that. And our special guest in studio is the Matt Tantow, the Ryan Seacrest of Flagstaff. <laughs> oh, you wish, you wish. <laughs> I don't know how I got suckered into this, but you, I'm here hey. on a Friday lunch break yeah. noon here. You volunteered the best for lunch this. lunch break ever. Yes. You didn't bring your and, food in, though. And thank goodness you gave me a rundown of what I need to talk about today. Yeah, because well. There's some good stuff. There's Let's, some, I mean, some very good things to talk Bruce about Bruce Jenner here. could take a whole hour in itself, <laughs> but we'll... Uh, we that's, got a few other that's things a whole to issue in himself. So, Matt, let's yes, talk Jacob. about you for a second. Okay. You are a man of many talents. You anchor the news. You used to work for Channel 2 here. You were a weatherman. Oh, I was. Yes. Part-time. Part-time. Yeah. Filled in for the uh, famous Lee Borden when he was off. Right. We love Lee. Yes. Uh, pilot. You're an airline pilot. Not airline. I fly a plane. I don't work for an you airline. You have a plane, oh, right? You have a plane. I have a plane. And you fly it. Matt Tantow Airlines, yes. Okay. Yeah. Really yeah. Cool. yeah, you fly yourself. To destinations, which amazing destinations, and you, you know, refuse to take me with you. Wickenburg which really and Selegman, Arizona, <laughs> are just amazing. You go to Phoenix, though. I do the big yeah. city every once in a yes, while. It's yes. pretty cool. You get out of the bubble of Flagstaff. Uh, yes, and then finally, you work at the student union. Oh, I do. That's yeah. that's really what pays the bills. Ultimately. Right. What this, do you do there? Oh, well, I sort of run the student union. Wow. So if anybody's listening and you have complaints, you know where to just call Jacob. He can get the yeah, information. Yeah, I'll take to care me. of that and I'll <laughs> get it up. to Matt. Yeah. No problem. But uh, yeah, that's what I do in my day job. That allows me then to do things like this radio show, right? Which I'm on my fun. lunch hour right now, and then uh, you know fly planes and do the weather and do the news and do whatever. So. Yeah, it's good to be Matt Tantow. Oh, it is. That's why we have you coming in here. <laughs> but, you know, you are a close second, Jacob Larson. Oh, well, <laughs> I don't mean sports to brag direct, or anything. Sports director, talk show host yeah. from the great state of Oregon. Oh, there we go. <laughs> I didn't even say it this I time. I know. Well, somebody, I mean, they don't even have a football team. I mean, they sort of no. root for the Seattle we, Seahawks. We, but do we, saw, don't we saw what them happened. Up, Matt. We saw what happened there. Do not so. bring them up. We'll talk about the Super Bowl. And how I was in the fetal position by the end of the game. It was just very sad and depressing. It's okay, Jacob. Oh man. It'll be okay. I'm still not over it. It's like a it's like a just a sore wound. It is for many people, I think, but mm. oh well. All right. Well, Xavier's not here. We were gonna play a game that Xavier came up with. I know, but we'll, we'll, we'll wait. Hopefully he'll show well, up. Hopefully yeah. he'll show up. We'll be able to get to the game. It's supposed to be fun. So we'll so move on. Okay. He's busy. Um, we busy. were also going to talk about how Xavier had his first Big Mac this week. He did? Which, yes. Where was I? You were not around. So you talk, guys don't invite talk me Talk to me this, this Big Mac thing. So yeah. Does, does man not Should eat? we wait for Xavier? No, no, no. no we no, can talk about better. it a little okay. bit. <laughs> Behind wait, whoa, whoa, his whoa. back. Back up. Okay. Yeah. Well, the executive so producer is getting upset. Over, <laughs> <laughs> over the weekend, I was hanging out with um, a mutual friend, and he was telling me how Xavier was vegetarian. Hmm. And then I was like freaking out. I was no, like, time out. You thought he was a vegan. Did I? That was the text I received. Oh, oh my gosh, Xavier, are you a vegan? <laughs> Something. And I was like... That's more than vegetarian. Yeah. Anyway, so I called him, and he was like, no. And I'm like, you're from Texas. You can't, you know, not, you know, you have to you be have able to, to eat. Meat. Yeah. And so apparently th- th- that was a lie. So now he's no, eating a big No, he most pack. definitely... Yeah, he ate it. It was his first time. Was it good? I went out and got it for him when we, we w- on Monday when we were anchoring the news because Xavier anchors, I do sports. So I took his car. That, that'll oh, be no. important for the next story I'm going to tell you. <laughs> okay, so we're talking about a man <laughs> who was a vegan, and you decide for his first... It was a rumor. Okay, it's vegetarian. Not true. Does it's he not eat true. meat at all? Yes, he loves, okay. he loves to He's eat beef. Texas. But I was really concerned that you chose to take a no. Big Mac to him. No, he enjoyed it, too. I mean, it was are, weird. There are better places in this town, yeah. like Diablo Burger, to sure. take him to. Oh, than, so good. Yeah. Uh, yeah, a big, big... Can I say something? Maybe Never been. Just, I haven't been to cheap. Diablo maybe Burger yet. Okay, next week, we're going to go. Have you ever been to Diablo Burger? No. You should go this week and talk about it on the show next week. Okay, we'll do that. Invite Last me. night, Xavier and I me. went to Chili's. Well, because there, and I had a great burger there. 
<laughs> that was really good. Chili's is a step up. That's yeah. nice. You know, how about next you just go to Applebee's or Arby's? I mean, it works just <laughs> as well. Jack in the box, because it's quality. Oh. Nah, no. No. So anyway, his quote after he ate it was, it's disgustingly delicious. And then he said, oh my gosh, I'm out of breath now. I feel like I've gained five pounds. <laughs> I wish he was here to defend himself at all. But so going back to I borrowed his car. Yes. The stipulation was I get to take his car, but fill it up with gas. Once again, we're speaking to the boy from Oregon on this one. Tell us. In Oregon, Oregon, people fill up your car for you. As in like employees of the gas station. Yes, they come out, the gas station attendant fills your car for you. You hand them your card. I need Fill it with the regular. Do you tip? Them? Bada bing, bada boom. You don't tip no. them. That's their job. <laughs> now, in, in the world of in the world of uh, America, prior to like 1990, none of you were born, so that's good. But there <laughs> used to be something called uh, the old man here talking full service gas station. So you'd go. They'd get, clean your windshield. No, they you know just like the movies. You know, you they clean your windshield, they pump your gas, and it was like you paid for it. And then we came up with this idea called self-serve. And mm. that is where the full-service idea went away. I think but there's not, only two states now. Not in Oregon. And, and second state, second state. Jersey? Jersey. Yeah. That's it. Okay. So, anywho, I'm filling up the gas. I oh, get no. there. I'm using Xavier's debit card. Oh, this is good. This is like fraud and filling up the <laughs> yeah, gas. Yeah. <laughs> I'm, I'm sure totally mom's bad. real proud so, right now. <laughs> yeah, I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I hope I you copied those money. numbers down for a yeah. later date. <laughs> No, but it asked me for his zip code. I'm like, I don't know his zip code. So I'm calling him. <laughs> which then he's screaming at me, why are you calling me when you're you, pumping yes, gas? You're that's going a good to explode. Way, yes. I had no idea that was a I thing. I didn't know that either. Static electricity. That, really? that cannot be true. I see people do, like, pump, I pumping. don't talk on the phone when I'm pumping gas. Tantau, people talk on the phone all the time when I'm, they're pumping gas. I've seen that happen, though. Like, oh. I'd be next, and he's like, people yelling at the phone. You've seen friends. people talk explode? No. <laughs> Talking on the phone. Pumping gas. <laughs> Hence, probably just another reason why we should have people pumping people our gas. People should for do us it so for you. Just talk on Every the phone. state should be like Oregon. No, no. they should. No, it should not be. <laughs> no, I, besides the weather, I'm good with Oregon. I, t- I was just in Portland. I just talked to my grandma. She said it's raining. It was raining on Sunday when I left Portland. She said it's raining just. Oh, yeah, you were just in Portland. Yeah, it was in Portland. It's a pretty cool little city, I'll be Where honest. Where did you with stay? You. Uh, well,. It w- uh, Crown Plaza, to be exact, uh, across the river. But it was just, I took a little light rail train over into the Pearl District. Yes, the Pearl, you know, very nice, Pal very Books, swanky. a lot of breweries, yes. pubs, pretty cool yes. place. Ate at two really good restaurants mm-hmm. when I was there. Mm-hmm. So um, pretty nice, sort of a Flagstaff, but bigger. It does feel like Flagstaff, doesn't it? And more it? moisture, right? Yes, a, a lot more moisture but, falling from the sky. <laughs> yeah, you know, fog and things like that. But yeah, oh, hence we, we The have river's it. beautiful, though, river, the bridges. Well, mm-hmm. So yeah. it's cool. It's a really good city. So I now I didn't get gas there, so I didn't get to experience that. Somebody else pumping my gas. You would have loved me. that, though. I would have loved it, but yeah. nonetheless, Portland's a pretty cool city. I'm glad you enjoyed your time there. That well, makes it me... was Portland. It wasn't like where are you from? Like Medford ish. Where are you from? <laughs> Med- Medford. Dreadford. We call Dreadford? that Dreadford because nobody nobody likes that place. Oh man. So wish... Jacob, you got to pump now. What in the end? Yeah. You got the gas in the car, and you got his oh. Big Mac back to Okay, full disclosure, this was not my first time pumping gas. Okay. I mean, I've done it before. My, I, You don't, like, pull up and just sit in the car and wait for <laughs> someone to come out? No, I did do that once. <laughs> One time, actually, we were on a road trip up to Seattle. It was really late at night. We didn't leave. We were with our neighbors. We didn't leave till like, after midnight. We're driving up, um, and we're in Washington. Now it's time to fill up. And my friend's mom is driving at that point because we were all kind of switching off because it was late. Um, and you and forgot what state in. you were in. Yes. And we're just sitting there. Nice. And then I'm like, oh, Jody, You need to get out and pump the gas. Yeah. And she's like, I don't know how to do that. And <laughs> oh so I God. got out and did it. This is probably when I was like 15, 16. Wow. I, I think I just had my permit at that point. Well, what are you now? Like. Well, I'm 17 19 now. <laughs> oh, 19. Okay. <laughs> that was years ago. But still, yes. it's just, it's weird for us because, you know, it. Washington's really close. It's about a half hour drive from my house. Yeah, and it's over the river. Over the river. There we go. It's, yeah. Over the river and through the woods. Okay. Xavier's yes. not here, so I'm going to sing for you. Do you have any music to play? Because I don't want to listen to that. <laughs> <laughs> 
<sighs> okay, so congratulations on pumping gas. Yeah, I did and, it successfully. And getting Xavier his Big Mac back, right? Yeah. No, I think that was a big moment for him to have a first Big you Mac. Should, you guys should go to Diablo Burger, though, because if will. you're going to have a hamburger, you're going to eat meat, that's the place okay, to Okay, here's the it's question, really though. Good. Diablo Burger or In-N-Out? Diablo. It's different, right? I had this I had this whole conversation with somebody. Really? Because so, they were trying to compare, like, Smash Burger against Diablo Burger against In-N-Out, and I was like, listen, In-N-Out is... It, they're sort of like different categories, right? right? So I really see In-N-Out as being a fast food in comparison to a McDonald's, a Carl's Jr., something like that. So In-N-Out is the best when it it's comes the to best like fast food burger. drive-through yeah, burger, sure. right? There we go. I think so. Yeah. Now, if you're not from basically Arizona West, you don't know what we're talking about. Right. But, uh, and granted, we're AM, so we might be bouncing off the ionosphere or something, but... <laughs> I'm pretty sure I can't hear this station. What was that word? Ionosphere, but I'm pretty sure I can't. Do you want to explain what that is for our listeners? No, it's not Dale Hoskins' uh, 121 (laughs) class right now. So, Um, But so on and so forth, and you can't even hear this signal like past, you know, uh, the mall, so it doesn't really matter. (laughs) But uh, but we're online. We are, kjackradio.com. But then Smash Burger, like Diablo Burger, Smash Burger, Five Guys. Oh, we went to Smash Burger, Holly. Those are like a little different. Those are like more gourmet. I like Five Guys. We have those in Oregon. Smash, I think, is better than Five Guys, and I think Diablo. I like Smash. It was good. It was good. Holly didn't like it. Xavier, I don't remember what his feelings were on it. I just remember the fried pickles, trying that. Those are good. Yeah. Yeah. Those Those are good. Really, Really, really good. Love the fried pickles. So I think you know Flag, Flagstaff has some good places to eat, though. Oh, I think better than better than the... McDonald's and Chili's. I don't know. Mean to, <laughs> not, I'm not trying to bag on Chili's, but come on, there are. Better we could places. have had a sponsor there. Thank you, Matt. Well, not now. <laughs> though I know I know one of the managers there. She's oh, awesome. do you? Yeah, Deborah is her ma- name. She's Hi, excellent. Deb. Yep. Hi, Deb. She's listening. I'm sure. All right. So what else we got going on here? Right. We're just well, we were going to play the game, but we no, we game. we're, we're going to take a break now. Oh, that's good. We can talk about Super Bowl. When yeah, we come we're going to come back, talk about Super Bowl, and then <clears throat> vegan Beyonce. I'll let you all know what that's about. And lip syncing. Be- uh, oh, no, that's somebody else. That'll, uh, that's Mariah. Mariah Carey, Mariah Carey. Too many failed people. at lip syncing. Okay, we'll be right back. And we're back. Did you enjoy that music? <laughs> <laughs> you know, it's such a nice transition from yeah. our talk show to that music. <laughs> that music. <laughs> we're going to have to figure out something to do. We will. About that. There's usually, like, we could play our own music, but the chord is missing. So that really peeves me off. Well, it's good. It keeps people awake. Yeah, if wake we, up. If we put them to sleep, <laughs> you have this really nice, calming music to wake you up to. Yeah. Or with. So, okay. So you want to talk? Tw- I'm tweeting. You're tweeting. That is amazing. So that was our game today, too. I was so upset. I was getting ready for that. Our maybe, game? Maybe we It was play. Tweet or Deceit I by know. Xavier. I was so bummed. He, he was had, so excited, He, he was so excited. He made up uh, fake tweets and all this stuff. So much work. To see if we could decide if they're real tweets or not. and Oh, it would have been good fun. Maybe there's time. Maybe he'll, Maybe he'll show up. Okay, okay, so what do you want to... Let's talk about the Super Bowl. We got lots to cover about the Super Bowl. My Hawks lost. I hear Seattle's like a morgue. Sad, oh, sad, did we sad. Already talk? Okay, we know. Seattle lost. <laughs> because You know, who, I have to relive it every day. To... <laughs> who throws a pass? Run... The With ball. five yards to Run go. Run the ball. Run the ball. Run the ball. Best running back in the league, yep. and you no, throw a pass. No, but we throw a pass. So, yeah. yeah, they can be sad, but let's be honest. I don't really know Really mad. Phone. Matt's phone's talking to wow. us now. Siri. I don't, I don't know what's going on. Okay, Google. Uh, it's not Siri. I don't oh. have an Apple. I don't have an iPhone. <laughs> He's not that fancy. No, no, no. No, this is Matt Tantow we're talking about. Okay, Hi, commercials. Guys. Holly wants to talk about commercials. Okay, so. Overall arching theme of the commercials, depressing. Yeah. Oh. Emotional. There were, yeah, Emotional. There were they like pulled at your heartstrings. Yeah. I did not like them. It's the f- like the nationwide one, right? And yeah. now I'm dead. Well, <laughs> hello. That was sad. And the dog, the puppy, oh, like what? Yes. The so puppy, sad. the Budweiser. Oh, one. oh, those always get yes. me. Yeah, always get me. What do you guys think about the um, like a girl one? Did you guys see that one? No, no. Which one was that? Is that where they like run like yeah, a girl? Oh, like that no, yes. that one was good. You that, know, I like that one. That yeah. was really creative. Really good. You really, know, really good. I really felt. Uh, I think emotional. It seems like the commercials were very emotional. Very. I think they were all. Uh, very had a pretty important message to them, or at least some of them did. And it's really interesting because the backlash that people 
received or the the uh, commercial the companies received like the nationwide backlash people were like oh my gosh how could you do something like that but it's like here you are the largest live sporting event of the year on televised or the largest here's your televised. chance here's your chance to send a message and they it's did really it. interesting some did, but people didn't like that. They really liked more of the let's be happy, let's have fun. A Doritos don't, commercial. Don't depress me. You, my favorite commercial was the Katie Couric, Brian Gumbel. Oh, yeah. Well, yes. In Talking car. about the internet and then in the car. Yeah. The Katie, BMW can you twerk? Or something? Yeah. <laughs> yeah, can you twerk? <laughs> <laughs> I kind of wanted to see her like twerking like, at the end. but All dancing in the car. Yeah. I don't even remember. Was that a BMW? A BMW I. I, I so, yeah, funny I, thing is, over yeah. break, I was not, not to... Not in, in addition to everything else I do, uh, I was in Europe, <laughs> and um, oh, <laughs> oh my yes, goodness. I'm that guy. Did you fly to Europe? I'm uh, not in my plane, uh. but uh, would your plane I went make to the BMW, it to Europe? I went to the BMW uh, factory, their museum, really in Germany. Yeah, and I got to check out the i3 and like the i5, and? which are these electric cars. Um, Brian, I kind of like the look of them. Yeah, Brian Gumble and Katie Kirk were not there, but um, you're kidding. Yeah, they're pretty cool looking. So. But, yeah, so I think that's the car they were advertising, yeah. the i3. the all-electric. Yeah. But it's really yeah. funny because it's funny then they use that flashback about, like, what the internet what was. Is the, yeah. What is the what A is the with a the circle? And, like, they don't even say dot .com. They don't even know what dot .com. He's like, dot uh, .com. AOL.com. What does that yeah. mean? Yeah. <laughs> it's like dot .com. So <laughs> it's really funny. Can you define the internet? <laughs> yeah. I just, I thought that commercial was really good to use the flashback. Yep. And utilize it with the new technology. Smart move. Smart move. Yep. Really, Especially really because good. if you think about people that were maybe in their teenage years in 91, yeah. or whenever that Today Show yeah. clip was, they are in their 30s, i.e. me. You're going to have a lot of people now, relating to that. who has the money to spend on a new car? People Those in their people. 30s and 40s, right? So I think that's Look really creative. Matt breaking down the advertising in the marketing. In the market. No, you know, that's... Uh, I learned in in one of my classes here at NAU in the EMF program. Shameless plug. Shameless plug here, folks. I learned that when you start hearing like songs from your generation, like on car commercials, Mm -hmm. they're targeting you. They want you. And when it's a Cadillac commercial, you should really feel old at that point. (laughs) (laughs) Okay, moving on. Halftime show. Katy Perry performed. Missy Elliott showed up. Lenny Kravitz was there. But what really stole the show was Left Side Shark. (laughs) I loved him. Talk to me about that. Left side shark. <laughs> Katie's up there dancing. She's got two sharks side by side. One of them knows exactly. The right shark knows what he's doing. Like, Left on. shark was just flailing his fins <laughs> sporadically. <laughs> was that in, along with the beach balls? That yes, legs? that yes. whole thing oh, on the beach yes. thing. The left I want to get you some, uh, one of those beach ball outfits. I think you'd look <laughs> really good in one. You know what they were saying? That outfit that Katy Perry wore kind of looks like the outfits that you workers wear? at Hot Dog on oh. a Stick wear. Oh, the, you mean the one in the beach scene? Yes. Okay, not the flaming one that she no. had on earlier. When okay. she rode in on the lion. What was that all about? <laughs> Hello, the song. It was a tiger, not a lion, right? Well, isn't that song? Whatever. Ti- yeah. It was a tiger. It was a ti- yeah. What? Come on. If you're going to talk about it, get right. it straight. Get the song <sighs> straight, Jacob. It was a liger. I'm 35 years old, and I know, I know what the theme of that show was. <laughs> so what, what? did you watch the halftime show, Matt? Oh, I, no, I was stuck on a plane, but I was watching it earlier today so I could talk to Oh, you. and? I liked it. I thought it was a good halftime show. You thought show. she... Pr- so here's something really funny, though. I, so I was like, it was a good halftime show, right? I saw all 15 minutes of it. I had to, like, change my IP address and make them think I was out of the country because the NFL blocks everything. But <laughs> um, but who none, knows how to do that? Uh, well, I, I know. Matt does. I just Googled Matt it. Tantow does. Just watch out, people. Um, it's probably illegal. Probably. Uh, but <laughs> here we go. So get this. So yeah. the, the halftime show is great. And I think if you go back, like, the last 10 years... They haven't been so great, right? Because ever since the uh, little Janet Jackson incident, you oh, were all like five. I don't know how old you back. were. Yeah. You know, then like the following year, we had Paul McCartney. You know, it's like, oh, dear. Oh, dear. So you did research. Top 10. Top I am 10, so proud of according you. According to Billboard, top 10 halftime shows, folks. Okay. Michael Jackson was like number 10 back in 1993. They're putting him at 10. 10. The king of pop at 10. Wow. Well, you know, he. Who's one? Please what? tell me Prince is one. No, he's in here though. So <laughs> number nine, Aerosmith in sync and Britney Spears in two thousand one. Yeah. 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 Eight, Paul McCartney, two thousand five, right? Yes. So that was after Janet. Janet though makes it uh number seven. I think Justin Timberlake was her saving grace there. Yeah, though. it was a help it was help. Yeah. Though. And of course then like this is who we had. We had like Paul McCartney in five and then here for number six, the Rolling Stones in two thousand and six. Mm-hmm. 
Of course, we had Beyonce in 2013. Xavier would be just so mad that she's so low on the She's only five. What, what number? Yeah. Five? Five. Wow. Bruce Springsteen, uh, 2009. Bruce was okay. He's yeah. old. Madonna, 2012. Madonna, Madonna did, did a good well. show. Yeah, Madonna did, did a good did. show. U2, 2002. I don't remember no. that one at all. What, Nobody what remembers U2. And do you know who number one is? Prince. Yes! 2007. <laughs> yes! So, I Oh, think- my goodness. I said that. During the halftime show, I said, nobody's ever going to beat Prince. Yep. I said that. And Xavier's like, what about Beyonce? Number five, according to. Five to one. Winner, winner, chicken dinner. I'm Um, not competitive at all. No. (laughs) No. But no, it was really interesting. But I think uh, think, uh, Katy Perry did a great show. I mean, the number of costume changes and yeah. the set changes was yeah. impressive. Yeah. Uh, the songs were good. The whole so. glow-in-the-dark ball kind that of thing. That was a good idea. Started out with the Pepsi logo. Yes. and then Yeah. Yeah, it worked out Now, were those fans well. or were those people? No. Okay. I heard something about those were dancers that they hired and had something to do with ASU. Okay. Oh, wow. And they, like, shuttled them in just for the halftime okay. show and then shuttled Shuttle them out. right out. <laughs> because because one, the stadium's filled. Fact, yeah. yeah. And one, one year, they used, like, you could be like if you were a fan, they put fans down on yes. the floor, and maybe they do that every year if they have enough room. But no, it turned out it looked really good. I liked it. Uh, it was a good show. Did you like Lenny Kravitz showing up? Hey, you know what? Why not? Actually, that uh, that was that flame song, Fires, yes. and she had her fire yes. dress on, and yeah, it looked good. Yeah, he played the Katy Perry song. Yeah, it was good. Why yeah. not? Why not yeah. throw some Missy stars? Elliott revive yep. from the dead? Bring some stars. I don't back. really remember her, but some of the songs I know. I Maybe guess I don't remember her. I don't remember her. How? What? Xavier would be appealed right I'm now. I'm appalled. Well, I mean, Xavier probably will never come back on this no. show again, and I won't be invited back. Um. <laughs> Do you know Missy Elliott at all? I know who she is. Okay. Do I listen to her music. Uh, you used to? Uh, <laughs> <laughs> Do you listen to it when you fly the plane? You should. Can you listen to music while you yeah, fly a plane? Yeah, you, you can. can. Yeah, you got a little, I got a little aux cable in there. I Do put you, in. does it, is there like a speaker in there or does it just come through it your comes headphones? It comes through your headphones. And okay. then what's really cool is when ATC talks to you, it blocks the music out. So, oh. yeah, it actually is set up for that God. specific reason. What do they say to you? Like who? Like the people in your do you have to like request like I'm coming in? <laughs> yeah, 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 you do. Do you hey. talk like a pilot too? Like, <laughs> I do. Hey, hey the seven eight one eight Victor, Flagstaff oh. Tower. Whoa. Yeah, and then there's a guy named Bob at the Flagstaff Tower. Okay, Bob. when I graduate, Bob. will you take me up? In the I will. Plane? I will. Yes. Yeah, yeah. Can you maybe. take me up in the plane? I already oh, graduated. Wow. How many seats are in said plane? Uh, four. Oh. Wow. wow. We should have went. For we my could birthday. all go. <laughs> Wow. Wow. Okay. Uh, let's move. <laughs> New topic. New topic. <laughs> Shall we segue now? <laughs> segue out lip of sync. Matt's plane ride. Oh, yeah. The lip sync battle that occurred on The Tonight Show with Jimmy oh, Fallon, that Will Ferrell, so and Kevin Hart. They killed it. This whole lip sync thing started back when Jimmy did Late Night. Uh, started with John Krasinski, star of the best show on television, The Office. Yes. Go on. Keep going. <laughs> You've got the history here. You're doing very well. <laughs> yeah. I just love John Krasinski and everything that has to do with The Office. But I would have to say Will Ferrell and his rendition of Let It Go <laughs> and the throwing of the glitter, he killed it. And Kevin Hart, he sang Katy Perry Roar. Drew Barrymore showed up for a little dirty dancing. <laughs> and I just love the lip sync battles. It's always a good time. No, lip sync battles are great. I think they're bringing it back. You know, it's yeah. one of those things that might have I, I want to it's do. It's coming back. I want to do lip sync battles. Like, that's what I want for my birthday is everybody to lip sync battle. Mom, are you listening? When I get home, <laughs> we're doing lip sync battles. <laughs> oh. No. That's what I want. Uh, I bet she cannot wait. She's probably practicing Aesthetic. right now. Uh, the only thing is, I don't know if my brother would do it. When is your birthday? June 11th. Oh, well. Well, too bad it's not during the year when we all could participate. You have to send well, a video. you'll have to <laughs> travel to Oregon once I actually, again. I actually will be there in June, long oh. story short. Really? Yeah, there's a wedding I'm going to oh. in Portland. Yeah. In Portland. Mm-hmm. I'm just 25 minutes south. Oh, well, well, it's too bad we're going to miss each other. <laughs> <laughs> okay. <laughs> oh, I hurt his feelings. All right. No, we're going to talk about how Beyonce has started this new vegan thing. Oh. She has a <laughs> she has a delivery service. Oh, I heard about this. I'll okay. Yeah. She has a delivery service for vegans that delivers vegan food. It's, she's collaborating with of course Jay-Z. Yeah. And this um they took on a 22-day nutrition challenge. 
back in December, and now they're like all about being vegans and they're trying to get everybody to be vegans, which mm. I'm not sure I'm excited about, mm-hmm. but, uh, you can do the 22 day da- challenge and they will deliver vegan food to your home. Beyonce do you will. you know how much it costs though? Did you hear? It, it was like $600 yeah. or something. It was like a lot. Oh, they said the organic gluten-free, dairy-free, soy-free and non-GMO meals. What is left? At that point. <laughs> well, you know what's great is, I mean, the best part about this is you're buying, you're spending all this money on this food, but yet they're driving a car that probably has leather seats in mm-hmm. it and rubber tires mm-hmm. and who oh, knows hybrid. what else. Yeah. <laughs> Talk about GMOs. I mean, like lead paint for who, you know. <laughs> so uh, <laughs> I'm glad that they're worried about what they're eating. But in terms of if they want to save the world, if they're going to save the world, yeah, I'm but, not sure it's going to make a huge impact, but to each their own. Yeah. Maybe More power to them. They say that the meals c- are between nine seventy six and sixteen fifty. That's a lot per as in, meal. As in like nine dollars, nine dollars and seventy six wow. cents to sixteen dollars. You know, 50 if Xavier cents. was in here, he could tell us. You can get a Big Mac for how much? Seven dollars. <laughs> yeah, there you go. Is that really? Well, it was like six sixty nine okay. I mean, minus the vegan part. Here's the thing, yes. though: in this state, you have sales tax, which we don't have in Oregon. Oh, you know, I noticed that. I, Isn't that the greatest? You thing You go ever? buy something for twenty five dollars. It's twenty five dollars. That's yeah. amazing. Isn't that great? Yeah. I always I go to the store and I'm like, oh, this will be three bucks. That's great. No, wrong. <laughs> but it's at least more we have like ten percent sales tax here, so it's easy to figure it out. Yeah. What's terrible is when you're down in the valley and it's a lot more. Yeah. I hate but, that. So yeah. So. Uh, $16, though. That's a lot of money. That's a lot of money. Per have. meal. And you're doing this for 22 days. It's probably not even good. I don't know. Oh, it's probably good. Beyonce's really? all fired up about it. Hey, you know what? Go for it. Hey, if Beyonce's doing it, it's probably, you know, a good deal. <laughs> she says, all you have to do is try. If you can't do it, if I can do it, anybody can. Well, there Inspiring you go. words by the is. Queen Bee. <laughs> yes. All right, we're going to take another break, but when we come back, we're going to talk about Bruce Jenner. Uh oh. Mariah Carey and her lip sync fail. Not her first. No. <laughs> and the Grammys. And hopefully, Xavier will join us soon. Yeah. We'll be right back. And we're back. That was a much better song. Yes. So over much the break. Better. Even though we cut it off short. We do have Xavier back for a brief amount of time. Woo! I, his mic, mic his mic isn't on. It He's is on, on, isn't it? It's on. Turn him up. Turn me up I can't hear you at I, all. I can. I can't hear you. Yeah. Oh, God. oh, oh God. man. I mean, that, hold Here, on. Do, you, I, hold do on. you want to share a mic? What's Here. That? Program. We gotta go to program. Hello. Am I on now? Yeah. yeah. You. Say okay. hi to your mom. Hi, hi, mom. I know you're listening. And actually, the GF is listening to this one, and uh, she's telling. This on is y'all. great. So just so you all know. Uh, that that was some audio production class. Right? I know. Yeah, I was, Matt, hey, that the, was yeah. good. Thank the goodness you were here. The program button, the program button, has to be pushed. So thank that's goodness amazing. you were here, Xavier. We talked about how you had your first Big Mac and your hashtag disgustingly delicious. <laughs> the G is hashtag listening? disgustingly delicious, oh. and it made my neck numb. Did you add that part? Oh, I just said what? you were out of breath. I, I was definitely out of breath. Definitely experienced some meat sweats. It was <laughs> real gross. Yeah, that's really. Cool. <laughs> Some, uh, yeah, it was it was quite Whoa. the experience. That was a classic Holly laugh right there. I just shut your microphone <laughs> off. You're <laughs> you're not talking anymore. Oh, I'm just really gosh. sad that I'm missing this episode with the I know. Ryan Seacrest of Flagstaff. Ryan Seacrest of Flagstaff. You know what we're gonna have to title this one? The one, the one without Xavier. Oh, oh that's so a good one sad. because Matt, you're gonna come on. You're gonna come on again, right? When I can actually stay for yes, a couple hours. Yes, I'll come on. Okay, so are we gonna play this game? Yeah, let's play your game. I've been waiting. Okay, so I came up with this genius and completely original idea, where <laughs> where I would go through some um, celebrities' twitters and then I would. Find some real tweets, some fake tweets, and then we're going to see if y'all can. You made up the out. fake tweets, correct? Yeah. Well, some of them, yes. Okay. So let's. Start or are off. they tweets somebody else tweeted, but not by that celebrity? I can't give away all the oh details. Oh, we need some. Okay. So let's start off with Fifty Cent. Okay. Oh, jeez. Do, does everybody what remember Fifty Cent? Now? Fitty. Yeah. Fitty. Matt, I know you uh, love his music. I listen to him. I got him on my iPod right here. Okay. <laughs> iPod. <laughs> my Nano. My iPod Nano. It's pretty awesome. Okay. We're calling this game Tweet or Deceit. have a Nano? I'm just making it up. That's a classic. Sarcasm. Got to read into it. Yeah. Because <laughs> okay. I'm not sarcastic at all. No, not never. at all. Jacob no. is okay. just Okay. Back to you, Xavier. Valley. He has some important things to do. So I do have go. some... News going on, actually. I'm doing it's my job. Break, he right? is the NAZ News Director. Uh, well, did we cover that well enough last time? Oh. Other, Xavier's just... in charge of okay, news. Okay, anyways, tweet or deceit is Come what on. I'm calling this. Okay, <laughs> so 50 Cent, did, do you think 
If you believe it's real, you say tweet. If you think it's fake, it's deceit, obviously. Does so everybody know what deceit one by means? One. Yeah. Okay. So deceit would be lie. Thank you, Matt. You're welcome. Walking dictionary. I, I am. Okay. Um, so 50 Cent, quote, I can't believe my grandmother is making me take out the garbage. I'm rich. F this. I'm going home. I don't need this. S. Tweet. Don't raise your hand. <laughs> Just tweet. say tweet or tweet. Just tweet. <laughs> tweet. <laughs> everybody thinks it's real? Yes. Do I say? All right. Well, everybody has a point. I thought that was an easy one. Okay. I think so, I saw that actually. Yeah. On I mean, well, that one was easy. We're starting off easy. That oh. was an old tweet that he made. That was just to warm y'all up. Who was that? Y'all? 50, 50 Cent. Oh, Matt. 50 Cent. Mm. Come on now. I knew that. On your that man. Hey, Hello. I got that tweet on my Twitter account because I follow him. <laughs> oh, yeah. Are you on Twitter? You got oh, your no, Google alerts. We're going to get you on Twitter, Matt. No, you are on Twitter. I followed you. Hello. No, I. <laughs> yes, uh, AZ pi- are you at sure? AZ Pilot. Oh, that's bad because I haven't. Oh. I haven't used that. In yeah, you have one tweet. Everyone follow Matt Tantau. <laughs> oh, Everybody. God, well, no, I don't know if that's. Not. But you can Google it. I'm following <laughs> oh, him. So if at Xavier and AZ today is following him, and the verified Nancy Harrison is following you. Matt. Yes. Well, you know, I only have which we're not going to get into on this show. Why? Anyway. <laughs> <laughs> okay. So. The next tweet is Kanye West, all right? Of course it is. All right, so do you believe that this is a tweet or deceit? Quote, I don't need a lot of people to like me. I like me enough for me. Deceit. 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 You think that's real, Jacob? Tweet. Oh, Jacob. Well, Jacob got that one wrong. Oh! 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 (laughs) (laughs) That was kind of a that was kind of tricky because it was like a parody. That sounds like something he would say. Right. Well, a parody account tweeted that out for him. So now, this next person. Sam Smith. Does everybody know who he is? We well, love yeah. him. And when we talk about Grammys, we can talk about Sam Smith some more. Yeah. Okay. Oh, you haven't gotten the Grammys yet? No. no we haven't. We need no. you. I don't know. Okay. Sorry. Well, if Jacob doesn't know anything about Do you all not know how to do some Google searches over here? Just kind of look up what's nominated, cover the big stuff? All right. That's well, why you're here. crickets. For the audience <laughs> listening, I'm really sorry that I left you with these children in this booth. I don't know how. Excuse me. <laughs> excuse me. How to Matt, run a Matt, show. Matt research. Good job, you Matt. It. Thank you, I Matt. Oh! Time out. Stop raising your hand. We <laughs> had, Why are you raising your Matt hand? Matt brought Jacob? in the top 10 ranked uh, <laughs> halftime, shows. halftime shows for the Super Bowl. Who's as number one Beyonce? Board. Wrong. It was Prince. No. What? what she was five. Number, was she five. was five. Okay. Was five. My, can I just say, um, Missy Elliott, welcome back from the dead. Just so you know, um, Bruce Springsteen, really Madonna, U2, and Prince beat out uh, Beyonce. U2? I don't, I, I don't, I don't, I don't even remember I don't that. Like U2. Two. Time for U2 no. okay. to take a nap. <laughs> Okay. Wow. Is that a little harsh? Yeah. Yeah. I'm just sorry. But okay, Katy okay. Perry, I'm you know Beyonce. Sorry to bring up on. old stuff. Tweeter just back to, to the go. game. Tweeter Tweeter to see. See. Okay, so Sam Smith loves his sad music, right? So yeah. do you think gives you all the feels. he tweeted, quote, I effing love sad music. Oh no, deceit. No, deceit, 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 deceit. He's too nice to say that. Y'all are all wrong. It's real. <gasps> no. That is real. That is a real tweet. This is a great game. Wow. Isn't everybody learning stuff? Great. Yeah. Man, I did a great job with this pre production. Okay. So now, Katy Perry, you know, halftime for the halftime yes. show. Okay, so do you believe tweet or deceit? Quote, OMG, Blue Ivy just pers- personally waved at me. My life is over. Tweet. 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 All right, y'all, I got that one right. Ooh. This game isn't really fun for me, but I thought that actually I it's added fun this for one. us. I got this one in. <laughs> I got fun. that one for Jacob because I really we're just win. happy you can make it in for a few minutes. I, I mean, know. you're okay. a busy man, a Matt, uh, a Matt, a Matt. You're like a Matt. You're a, you're like the Ryan a Seacrest man of all I trades. really am. I'm about to go on TV, guys. Uh oh, breaking whoop, whoop. news. Uh oh, breaking okay. news. So ready? So from Katy Perry, Missy uh, Elliott. Okay. Who is just rejuvenated, as we discussed b- before? Where, yeah, who's, we, yeah. who's tweeting this now? Missy Elliott. Okay. It's okay. your from minute it's wet yet. Yeah, bu- okay, go ahead. From minute it's wet. Okay. <laughs> anyway, whoa! So, <laughs> if you could see Not Matt's Italy. face right now, <laughs> he's never coming. Back. You don't like the rapping that I'm I doing? probably should do radio, not television, because I do make faces. <laughs> oh god. Okay. Well, yeah. D- did we cover how Matt cannot say the most simple names? Okay, no, we didn't what? talk Have about that. Have a great day. <laughs> Bye. <laughs> see ya. <laughs> Am I on? Okay. Oh, good. I off. Okay. He turned me off for a second, but yeah. Okay. Merry neighbors, Aaron. Tony. Er, okay. You know what? Adrian Granillo. That was a rough day. That was a rough day. Because it was a little like Fly by the Wire. Let's remember oh, this. Oh, was it Fly by the Wire? <laughs> just it some, was. Just two names. Two James names. Sasapis, okay. You know Mayor what? Okay. Jerry Neighbors. Tweet or deceit. Adrian Garola. Let's move on. Okay. Move on. <laughs> I'm not coming back to this show if you keep doing that. Okay. Missy Elliott. <laughs> quote, 
I believe the children are our future. No. Teach them well. Let them this? lead the way. Deceit. Oh, that's a song. Now that's let's literally. go to iTunes and get some Misty joints and dance. Deceit. Oh. Deceit? What? what? Tweet. I'm going to tweet that. That's, yeah, that, she's crazy. What deceit. Was that? What? From Missy Elliott. Do you know? Yeah, I know who and she is. And you said Deceit. Holly's Deceit. Deceit. Yeah. deceit. Yeah. Matt tweet. is Tweet. Tweet. Good job, Matt. That is a tweet. That no is a real kidding. Tweet from Missy Elliott. Isn't how that great? That how she's how like, that so Matt is definitely winning now. Yes. She's like, have for those of you keeping tabs at home. Jacob's she's competitive. Half, oh, what's the shot count on today's show? Oh, we've mentioned Oregon a lot. Oh, God. A lot of so is anybody like even like there right now, or are they just all They're just probably. Too drunk? We started a drinking game last week. Anytime I mentioned Oregon, well, it's Oregon Friday at noon. I don't know what the rest of any of you is doing. <laughs> but <laughs> so and it's 11 plan. o'clock in. In Portland. Oh, it's, well. Mind it's, you. It's going to be 1 o'clock in Texas. Yeah. Woo. Okay, okay. Next tweet. Okay. Taylor Swift, quote, being called high maintenance is a compliment. Tweet or deceit? Tweet. Deceit. 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 Tweet. deceit. 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 That's tweet not that. Taylor. Tweet, tweet that. Deceit. That's not Taylor Swift. Good job, Jacob. Or not Jacob. Sorry. Matt and Holly. Yeah. yeah. I am really losing. Why would Taylor yeah. Swift tweet anything like that? I know. She She's would... so nice. She's not... Is she, though? Yeah. Yes, she is. Mm. She is a good person. Not okay. a man. Mm. No, I like her music. Fun, fun I like the older stuff. Better. Conspiracy theory. Oh yeah, it's good. Conspiracy theory. Uh-huh. Um, it's believed that when Kanye interrupted her during the VMAs, that was her introduction into the Illuminati. Google it. Oh, good. We'll God. talk about that next. Show. And that's why. And that's why <laughs> next week came on the up and like let her. You know, it was like <laughs> welcome Illuminati. to our family, Taylor. And then she's never been bigger since. Can we agree? I don't know. I, I okay. need to do more research. Tweeter wow. deceit. Okay, tweeter deceit. Don't you have a new okay. script to be writing? <laughs> this is. <laughs> We're not going to talk about that on this show, okay. Matt. Okay, I'm sorry. Okay. You're busy. You're busy. So. <laughs> Okay, Ellie Golding. Oh. Uh, we're all familiar with the Jacobs Bay, right? Yeah, we love her. Jacob really Ellie. loves her. Ellie, NAU 2014. Right. Matt brought her here. Okay, for me. so quote, or tweet or deceit. Quote, I have a major tummy ache right now. <laughs> <laughs> tweet or deceit. 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 deceat. That deceit. never went out. I'm pretty deceit. sure that never <laughs> Come up Did with she tweet better? that last year when no. she was here? Yes. Okay. Can what? we talk about that? Uh, no. no. We no. did not. Oh, Wait, the no. bad no. 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 information. No. information. No. You don't what? name your source. No. <laughs> no. That was off the oh, record. Oh man. I'm sorry. Off I added the record. that one for Matt and Jacob. What? I knew they oh. would love that. It is deceit. <laughs> yes, it, it is. is. We can't explain that, but. The no. backstory. <laughs> if you knew, you'd be laughing oh, hysterically. Oh, God. You'd be in tears right now. <laughs> she did a good concert. Great concert. Great concert. She pulled through it. I have so many videos. <laughs> okay. Yeah, they all kind of. Yeah, this guy, Jacob, was in, like, Jacob. camping out at the Union all day. Yeah, I, yeah, first I fangirled. Line. Matt was looking was at me like, like I was crazy. <laughs> He's like, get your tickets over here, yeah, please. Get out. <laughs> and then leave. Yes. <laughs> all right. So next is the one and only Tyra Banks. Oh, Tyra. Okay, so Tweeter here. America's next top America's top next Next top model. Well, you guys did it at the same time. Okay, that was ready? cute, Matt. Yeah. Ready? Did they both pose? America's yes. next top model. model. Oh, I oh, oh, you want to be on we... top? Right? Yeah. yeah. Man, I'm Tweet or okay. deceit. Tweet or oh, deceit. Quote, so you know when you eat certain foods just to get the sauce into your mouth, celery for ranch, fries for ketchup, chips for onion dip? Tweet. Ew. Tweet. I don't like that. Tweet. Tweet, though. Tweet. I would say a tweet. Yeah, tweet. She wouldn't. She wouldn't eat the chip, but she'd suck the onion dip off of it. I don't know. You see, that was my. That's what I thought y'all were. I thought y'all were all not going to believe that she's actually eating real food. Oh, no, she would. But I mean, I guess she's not a model anymore, so uh, I don't know. But yeah, that was that's a real tweet. That, that was a real tweet. That was wow, a real Jacob, tweet. Isn't that really kind of psychotic? You're not good at this game. No. <laughs> Which game. really <laughs> makes me mad. Okay, so now the one and only Am- Amanda Bynes. Uh, a little crazy now. Uh, Amanda, Amanda, show. Huh. Exactly. Okay, so Twitter to see, quote, remember when I partied with those dancing lobsters? Hashtag TBT. Tweet? Tweet. 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 Y'all all think it's tweet? Yeah. Yeah. Y'all are all wrong again. Really? I made that I one up. Know. Can't you picture her tweeting that? Yeah. yeah. That, Hashtag that TBT. Good. I knew that one would throw you off. Okay. Ready for the next one, Lindsay Lohan? Oh, no. Lindsay. Even more of a mess. This love, will be good. This will be good. <laughs> gotta love Linz. I okay. hope it's a good one. So, quote. Um, did, wait, first, before I read this, did y'all see the Super Bowl commercial that she was in? Yes. Okay. I didn't even recognize her. Yeah, she looks not she looked wait, normal. what commercial was it? When she pulled up in the car to pick the kids up from school, and then oh, she was, like, running what? into things. Really? 
She looked like a mom. Yeah, that's that was her. L- Lindsay Lohan. Mm-hmm. Yeah, it was wow. the but only down, one. That let's you know, mothers out there. Sad. Let's just give them all a break. A few of them, you know, have a little afternoon Hi, cocktail. Mom. Have to pick the kids up. You know, <laughs> problem. I wonder if my mom's watching. My mom hasn't texted me that. My she's mom just listening. texted me that she's working. Oh. <laughs> not listening right now. One day though, you're gonna have moms on the show. That'll be fun. Yeah, we need to get the moms. Yeah, well, on. I want. I thought it would be a good idea to have our moms call in, but Jacob wasn't game for the first show. Well, I think his mom has to work. She works. She's educating the youth of America. Yeah. My we'll mom. Figure it out. My mom is also at work, but I mean, let's be honest, mom. Lunch you don't break. really. You're oh. just kind of. Oh, there. whoa, <laughs> whoa! That's not very nice. No, wow. she's a great. You apologize to your mom right mom, now. I'm very sorry. I love you. Yes. Very, very much. Yes. Don't <sighs> be. Wow, you're don't bad angry mouth text. her. Right. I know. Yeah. Holly, well, no, Holly's face looked like she was just about to cry. Are the texts That's coming really... in yet? I don't know. I don't have my phone. It's in my workspace. Your poor mom. It's in the cave. Oh, oh, hey, we just got a text from Haley Schickner, one of our sports reporters. What's she saying? Schick dog. <laughs> she just texted both of us saying, new drinking game. Every time Xavier says y'all, your show. Yeah. <laughs> oh, well, yeah, you that. are from Texas. Yeah. Have I already said y'all? Y'all? Y'all, yeah. you said it once. And okay. then she said our show is on point. Good. It's on point right now? Great. Because fleek. I'm just not exactly sure. Uh-oh, I got a text too. To I don't know. I'm, right oh, no. I'm getting a lot of texts right okay, now. Okay, Tweeter <laughs> Deceit. Okay, okay, Tweeter Deceit. This is the last one. So okay. should we, do, are we keeping points right now? Uh, Matt's I'm winning. winning. I'm okay. down by three. Holly's down by one. Are you oh. really keeping points? He's Jacob? competitive. Jesus. He admitted that. All right. right. <laughs> Lindsay Lohan ready. Quote, no, I didn't steal the car for my Super Bowl commercial. It was a gift. Tweet. Tweet. Wait. No, again. that's probably deceit. Actually. Wait, wait, wait. Say, say deceit. Again. Okay. Deceit. Tweet. <laughs> Quote, oh. no, I didn't steal the car for my Super Bowl commercial. It was a gift. Tweet. She wouldn't be Tweet. that quick to like Tweet. Tweet. be on top of things like that. No. Tweet. Deceit. Deceit. Tweet. Great job, Matt. What? That was a fake one. Matt, Matt wins. Matt, I'm down by four it, now. Is there a prize? <laughs> yeah. I, get, um, I get to come back on the show. You get to come back yeah. on the show. <laughs> Matt <laughs> wins an invitation. Prize? You're welcome, it's a good Matt. Thing that Matt won because I couldn't really invite Holly and Jacob back. They're going to be yeah. here. I know they're already here. We're already we here. We let him win. It's okay. Oh, <laughs> okay, is that the, is that the game? Are you all? That's the game. Yeah, that's the end that of that really game. Wow. Well, that was Xavier. Right? Yeah, that, was fun. that took Thank a lot you. of brain power. Um, lots of hard work. I almost didn't get to play, which I was secretly sad about while I was over there trying to type. But yeah, thank you for coming in. You're welcome. Did we we talked about Left Side Shark? Right? We did. Oh my! Do you oh, have any yes. comments on that? Left Side. Did y'all know that he like revealed himself? Yeah. No. They found his Tinder. Or the whatever, person. Stop they, it. <laughs> they found his Tinder and everything. I saw it on I think TMZ or something. On a scale on of one to ten, what would you rate his looks, Holly? Uh, uh a five. A five? Wow. No. That's I why he was in the shark <laughs> costume. And I not one of the dancers with face showing <laughs> yeah well i mean he was just I mean, a little off no his excuse i really was... wish you could all see matt's face while we're in here <laughs> <laughs> it is we just like slightly cam. concerned we need yeah. a matt, matt cam. Cam. well that camera's rolling oh, I just go, nobody knows what channel oh, it's on <laughs> <laughs> uh, uh, no, same thing but, with this station but it's okay that's all right yeah. okay my comment on left side shark <laughs> yeah he said that he just couldn't see in the suit i'm sorry you can sh- still flail your arms with some if we're a nation, if, no, no, no. Know. Yes, you're right. Yeah. Some people can't dance, I but he's dance. a professional dancer. Is, is that he? really your ex- Holly? Come on, I don't know. Holly, Katy Perry's not just going to let anybody <laughs> up there. I want to see his tryout videos. Right? His tryout. <laughs> <laughs> can, can we get your audition tapes, Left Side oh Shark? My gosh. Can we see you without the suit on? Just kind of. What if kinda... he like wasn't feeling good or something? Xavier, know. should we talk about the Grammys while you're here? Yeah. Okay, yeah. Let me pull up. Oh, who do we think is going to win um, Album of the Year? Who's nominated? I okay, let me. Yeah, I don't know anything about the Grammys. Uh, Matt did his, Matt did his <laughs> research. <laughs> Sam Smith, right? He has got a, he's got an Album of the Year. He's got uh, a okay. Taylor. No, Taylor? Taylor. No, it's too late. I think the al- it? It came out too late. It came out too late. I think she's only got a song. I don't think she has the actual uh, mm. album. Shake it off, Taylor. It'll all be good. I don't think it's Shake nice. It Off, though. That's not that song. I don't forget what it is. Beyonce is nominated. Okay. Oh. Thank you. You're welcome. Okay, this have booth song, doesn't like have that. Wi-Fi, so I can't look it up again. <laughs> really? And I don't have my phone. But I know oh, that Beyonce here. is nominated for um, Record of the Year, or Album of the Year, Beyonce actually. Beyonce is on there. I th- of course, uh, Xavier Sam wants Sam Smith that. is on there. I think, I think Sam Smith is just a... Beyonce changed the game so with that talented. digital drop. And what's his name with the funny hat? He's on Pharrell. 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 If Pharrell wins a Grammy, <laughs> please shoot me in the face. What? <laughs> He'll probably win. He's like in one category. That's He'll probably win. Me. He's a great producer, but I mean, that song is just not that great of a song. Well, no, no. It's like Pharrell is not good. Yeah. Thank you. Well, happy, happy, J- happy. I think Jacob has a point. Pharrell is not a good recording artist. He's a great producer. Yeah, I think he's got definitely some 
He has talent. something. I just don't know that it's. I don't think um, he's a singer. Actually, making songs. Yeah. Holly, are you trying to look up right now? Yeah. Well, I have AT and T, so I can't get out of this building if I tried. Um, I have AT and T. Oh well, they did put the new t- antennas. It on. It works Audrey. now. Jay Z and Beyonce's yeah, new on new the Run tour is also nominated for a Grammy, which mm. j- nobody's seen in here. Is what I'm I've guessing. I've seen parts of it, but it is so great, so so great, so great, so great, so great, my man. <laughs> are you making fun of me right now? No, that was my Jimmy Fallon impersonation. Oh, okay. Well, um, okay. Here we go. We got we got some did you nominations. Get it? Yeah, I'm Before getting me? there. What? I'm pretty amazing. Well, you, 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 this you, is why Tantau's quit using here. Yahoo. Use Google. I am. <laughs> You're a- using Yahoo? Are you, oh, oh, Kanye West is supposed to perform Jeeps twice. Right <laughs> really? <laughs> Kanye, Yeezus season is upon us, y'all. Wow. Record of the year. Here we oh, go, guys. You ready for okay. this? We got, uh, oh gosh, I don't even know how to say this. Fancy, right? No? Am I? Yeah, Fancy Iggy by Azalea. By Iggy. Um, Iggy Azalea. <laughs> Who's ah, this? Edward Chandelier by Sia. Yeah, yeah. Chandelier Stay with by me Sia. by Sam Smith. Sam yeah. Smith is oh, is nominated for as many Grammys. Shake it as off. Beyonce no, so album of the year, so record of the year, not album. So this is record of the year, album of the year. Let's talk about that. Morning phase by Beck. No. Mm-mm. Beyonce no. by Beyonce. Yes. Uh, X. X by Ed Sheeran. I heard that that, that, that is actually album. called Multiple. In the Lonely Hour, true? Sam Smith. I think, so, yeah. I think Sam yeah. Smith, Fer- Pharrell gets it for the album Girl a nomination. No, Sam yeah. Smith should win. I think it's Sam's either going to be win. Sam Smith yeah. or Beyonce. Yeah. Yeah. What about songs? You're a big you're a big Beyonce fan, aren't you? Beyonce is just okay. everything. It's, wow, she's just he wins. She's there. a queen of pop. Song of the year, though. What do you guys think? Shake it off. Do we no. talk about Mariah uh, Carey's lip sync fail? Oh no, let's no. talk about that really oh. quickly. You know that's yeah. not we're, the first we're coming one. up she, against it here. She fails at limp singing all the time. She really Have does. Have you YouTubed it? Yeah, Rockefeller Christmas at yeah. Rockefeller. Yeah. All I want for Christmas is you. She didn't lip sync, but they played like the raw audio just from her mic feed. <laughs> it was I don't know. Awful. It was just so pathetic because we all know Mariah's got pipes. Yeah, yeah. she can sing. And she's up no, there on stage. She could sing. She's up there on she stage could. lip syncing, and she totally just like screws it all up, and she makes this weird face, and then like walks off stage. And I noticed too, like when she messes up, she just starts dancing around. Yeah. That's her automatic. It's like it was so pathetic, though. Awkward. It's yeah. just not. I think she just needs to take a break. Like that's you're done. I mean, you, you said that last week that. These celebrities that want to remake themselves. Well, need but to no, just I'm hide. saying okay, sh- not take a break, just stop, <laughs> just stop, stop singing. I think it's like her time, or like bring it she's, down. And she's an amazing two. singer, or was she was an amazing singer, but she can't hit those notes anymore, mm-hmm. and it's showing, and it's kind of embarrassing. I thought, I, guess, I I I don't listen to her, so I don't know. Well, neither do I. But I mean, uh, when you do, but you it's know always that bad news. She's always been oh, good. Maybe she's uh, maybe it is time, but yeah. Everybody has their time. That's like really sad. Okay, lastly, let's hit on Bruce Jenner here. Oh. We haven't talked about this yet either. No. no. Yep. Oh. Oh Save my the best God. for last, last right. here, Bruce yeah. Jenner. Bruce, I said last week that I thought that was all fake. Your it reporter just made out. it in, by the way. It is now yeah, coming out that it's real, that Bruce is transitioning into becoming a woman. Okay, before oh, we well, jump the gun and okay. call it real, all of those yeah. articles are referring back to the same people article. How is that okay? Like, how is that? You just have one source talking to one tabloid, and, and then I'm, all I'm the other news. So like, if we if it. we look at his, uh, we got one minute left. Run up uh, since since uh, you know in the last ten years, what you know he's on mm-hmm. TV like and Kardashians, right? Yeah, Isn't that keeping him? Up yeah, with keeping up with. Do we think this might be a ploy? Like, really? A pub- pub- but there's it sometime? could be it could be, but he's doing a whole show about why this. this though isn't this like not something that you want pu- publicity for no but no i think like that, famous though so well no and what's bad is so it's really i mean okay if he if he if he is transitioning great but what concerns me is like is he doing this for a publicity stunt because if he is i think it's really then a bad thing for those people that yes. maybe are going through sets this. them back yeah, it just is not. It overshadows it. It makes a mockery yeah. of it a little bit. It's not. It's not really fair. So that's my no. only concern. I agree. Yep, I totally agree. All right. Well, great job doing the show without yeah, me. Yeah, thanks for coming well, in, thanks, Xavier. 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 Run Matt out, Tantow. Guys. Oh, thank, thank you guys. You for no, coming. thanks. It's been great. Bye, Holly, Xavier. Jacob. Xavier's leaving. Xavier's got Bye. breaking news to go do. Matt, He's thank busy. you for joining us. It's been real. It's been fun. It, it has, has not been real fun. You know, I heard that, but it doesn't matter who won <laughs> trivia. I did. Thank you, you did. Mm-hmm. And you'll never let me live well, that down. Well, I hope you come back, Matt. Yeah, Matt, we'll I have you back on the show again. Thank you. Thank you, Executive yeah. Producer Holly. All right. Join us next week again on The Potpourri, Fridays at noon. Thanks for joining us.